Hey, it's Witch Angel Nakora, and welcome back to Palm Gets Wi-Fi. Oh my god. This game is absolutely effing adorable. I love doing the voices for these little guys. Um, <clears throat> last we left off, we were trying to get to the, uh, the cafe. But if you look over here, we got a bit of a problem. We got a bunch of dogs waiting in line for something. So here we go. <clears throat> This line to the park is moving a lot more slowly than usual. To be more precise, it's moving so slowly that it's not moving at all. <laughs> Do you mind moving aside a little? We're trying to cross that bridge behind you. No can do. We've been in this line for an awful long time now. And it'd be simply terrible if we lost our place. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> the puns are real. <laughs> the puns are real. <laughs> terrible. <laughs> you gotta love it. <laughs> <clears throat> Here, you can have these old Baron's SAT books as our apology. Wait, we don't want these. Alma, isn't the weather today splendid? Not a cloud in the sky as usual. Discounting the one we're standing on, of course. They're ignoring you. They just unloaded a bunch of crap they don't want on us. <clears throat> I know that feeling. Also, I hate allergies. I can't wait to go to the park. I'm going to train hard and become stronger. Good luck with that. <laughs> you such a bitch. Are right, you over here? And uh, let's see. <clears> oh, <throat> huh? what is it, you dumb Seba? What if we use this rock thing as leverage to climb over the fence? Then we can get into the park and see what the problem in there is. The fence looks too high to climb even standing on top of the rock though. It would be great if they made this rock taller. That's it. We should make it taller. Ah! We have these books, right? See? If we stack them on the rock, it's a little taller. Still not tall enough, though. Yeah, looks like we'll have to get more stuff to stack on it. Oh well, here we go with the quest. Okay, we're gonna go up here. Do you have anything we might be able to borrow? Actually, I have, haven't had this giant potted cactus on me right now. <clears throat> How do you just happen to have something like that with you? And it's so spiky. That's okay. Hand it over. Pom! Please. Please. <laughs> You're strangers, though. How do I know if I can trust you two with it? Doesn't the fact we're in heaven prove that we're good dogs? There's no such thing as a bad dog. Only bad owners and bad upbringings. That is true. <clears throat> Trust me, if you're a good owner, then your dog will be a very good boy or girl. But if you're a bad dog owner who likes to like abuse your dog, which, by the way, is stupid and you should be locked up for it, then that dog will be a bad dog. So it's up to the person who owns the dog to raise it either good or bad. <clears throat> so Goldie here is right. <laughs> so every dog ends up here, regardless of whether they turn out to be trustworthy or not. How do we get you to test us then? How about you run an errand for me? Do you know Poppy? She owes me a few dog treats. Can you ask her for them for me? We'll do our best. So, um, that means we have to go to the cute little dog up front. <clears throat> I wonder what kind of dog she is, because I love dogs as much as I love cats and all other animals. 
I think she's like a Chinese hairless or something. I don't know. <clears throat> Hand over the dog treats. A daylight robbery? No, no, no. No, 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 no. We're here on Goldie's behalf. She sent us here to retrieve the dog treats you owe her. Oh, about that. I already ate them. <laughs> Period blood microwave! That makes no sense. What the crap? That makes absolutely no sense there, Pom. What the? You better back up a few paws. <laughs> what do we do now? How about you give her this instead? You received a Famicom. <gasps> I forgot. I, when I played this through the first time, I forgot she has a Famicom. <laughs> and Famicoms are like really cool because I've actually played on one when I was a kid. Because I was at this old one game store and they had a Famicom for like display and asked if I could try it out. And it was actually really good. I mean, it's a good system. <laughs> I guess we'll have to take this back to Goldie and explain what happened. But seriously, I can't believe she brought her Famicom with her. That is so cool. It's like Palm brought her laptop. That's pretty neat, ain't it? <laughs> Alright, here's Goldie. <clears throat> You're back. Where are the treats? About that. Poppy told us she's eaten them all. She gave us this thing instead. You gave Goldie the Famicom. It's not our fault. Honest to dog. Tatsuke, please give us the giant cactus. Calm down. I was testing you two, and you passed with flying colors. We did? Knowing Poppy, it would have been strange if you really did come back with dog treats. But what kind of test is that? There's no way we could have. No. Of course not. The test was about whether you'd come back to me with the Famicom. Eh? <clears throat> I could see you two stacking stuff on that rock thing over there, you know. That's why you want my potted cactus, correct? That's right. But why didn't you just use the Famicom? The bomb is pretty flat and way better for stacking than a cactus is. <gasps> I didn't even think about using it. You were so determined to make me trust you that you were totally distracted from your original goal. Honestly, <laughs> that's kind of adorable. I'll stop it, you. Here, you can have the Famicom. You received a Famicom. Yay! Now that I think about it, you would have ended up with a Famicom either way. But this method has the extra bonus of me trusting you. I like to think that counts for something. It does. Thanks. So, now we got the Famicom. <laughs> Have anything we might be able to borrow? No. I'm sorry. Y you don't need to apologize. Aw. Hey. Labra, I cannot wait to catch frisbees in the park. Me neither. That feeling of absolute bliss when you make a jump and catch. It makes waiting in line so worth it. For some reason, they're still ignoring me. Maybe they think you came to attend the books to them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we put the Famicom up here. Uh, okay, let's go back into town so we can find anything. <clears throat> Oh, uh, after this, I'm taking some allergy medicine. My nose is running like crazy. Help! I'm trapped! You okay? Don't you see there's a spider over there? It's an itty bitty dot lady. What the crap? The black speck? It's tiny! Normally, Puddle takes care of the spiders, but she's not home! Why don't you just go kill it with a tissue? What if I try to get it and it, it dodges? And it crawls onto my paw! Oh, come on. What's going to happen if it crawls on you? I'll die! Wait, you're already dead. <laughs> kind of an oxymoron, ain't it? 
That's impossible. <sighs> Here we go. <clears throat> Greetings, spider. Today you meet your doom. Can't we just coax it outside? There's no real need to kill it. No, then it might make more spiders. You have to kill it. <laughs> It has been slain. Thank you, thank you, thank you! You don't have to shout. Huh? What's all this commotion? These two just saved my life. Not really. I should be thanking you then. Here, have this. Saving Crest Life. You received a large inflatable dolphin. Okay, you brought that up to heaven? <laughs> what were you doing, laying in a pool? <clears throat> Thanks, I guess. <clears throat> a dolphin. Really? That's cute. Hmm. Alright, let's go over here and stack this up. Da -da 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 Alright, let's... You two over there! What do you think you're doing? Ah! Suck the pow pow. Can't tell me what to do. Z nap. Stop! Adios, bitches. And now we're in the park, yay! Okay, um. Oh, my head suck. Uh, are you okay? You were knocked out by that super fast frisbee for a while. Don't be so worried about me. It's gross. <laughs> Suck. Uh. Uh. Suck. Okay. Screw this. I'm just gonna go over here. Uh. Fuck. Come on. Okay, yeah, yeah. I did. Reach end. Succeed. Watch out for that frisbee! <laughs> Fuck! <clears throat> hey, wake up, you two. What? So, you finally regained consciousness. What are you two doing here? Sherman sent me to go after you when you climbed over the fence. When I found you, you were both lying there, both knocked out by the frisbees. We're here to try to fix the frisbee machine. Is that so? <laughs> He's going to eat us! Run! I'm not going to hurt you. I'm not going to lie. At first, I thought you two were up to no good. But it seems like you're actually trying to help. Why don't we work together? I'm Huss. We, are, we can already see us when you're naming this fight when you talk. But whatever. I'm Palm. And this city ass excuse for a manservant over here is Sebastian. It's Sheba. And who are you calling a manservant? Nice to meet you. Y you too. Huss has joined the party. I love huskies. In real life, I really do love huskies. They're so cool. They have those big eyes. They're so, mm, so cool. <coughs> Looks like an opening into the machine. If I remember correctly, there should be a control panel in there that will, that will reset it. I'm way too big to fit inside, though. Me too. I can fit. This hole looks like it was made for me. And I guess Huss and I are going to be left by ourselves out here. <laughs> Merry Christmas! Ho 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 mouth! Well, what the heck are you saying? <laughs> Look at the time. It's Yowie o'clock. What's she talking about? <laughs> She's... never mind. It's nothing. Palm, you're drooling a little. <laughs> well, who can blame me? Just leave already. 
<laughs> She's such a yaoi fangirl. <laughs> this is where the fizz bees are coming from. So fast. Sonic will be jealous. <laughs> Gotta go fast. It's a death bunny. More, looks more like a death turd. Speaking of turd. Don't you think Seba's tail is shaped a lot like one? <laughs> That's me. <laughs> if only I could see so no, that'd be fantastic. Holy shit, dude! This stuff is so old that it's solidified. I'm not small enough to run my way through. There's like a control panel looking thingy over there. Guess there's none in two, but turn back now. Oh well. We tried. <laughs> Durr. 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 Why are you making weird noises? I was trying to scare you. You always scare me. Wow, I'm all gross and dusty now. Don't wipe your filthy paws on me! So. Did you find anything? There was a control panel in there, but I couldn't reach it. It would take a hell of a tiny dog to fit in there. Hmm. Let's try to find a dog that fits the bill back. But we can't climb out of the park we, we, the way we came in. How are we getting out of here? Through the front door, of course. Sherman will let you guys through once he sees that you're with me. Oh yeah, I forgot you were on such good terms with everyone here. You will be too soon enough. Alright, so like the way we came, not gonna be hit by a frisbee! Oh, a frisbee's ahead, I hate that thing. <laughs> it's you two troublemakers from earlier! Yeah, we were both. Uh, join our gang. <laughs> we're a gang now? Hey, Huss, you're with them? Yep, we're helping each other out a bit. So even these delinquents are good for something, huh? Alright, come on through then. You know, that's from the last episode. We have, uh, this little, this little fella right here. Or actually, I think it's a girl. Her name is Chi. Hey, Chi, we need to borrow you for a minute. I'm sorry, Huss. I I'd love to help you out, but I can't lose my place in line. <laughs> you gotta be fitting me. If you don't help us, you're gonna be in line forever. Chi, how about I hold your place in line while you're helping them? Oh, good idea! Huss has left the party, and Chi has joined the party. I think she has a sharp hay, because... No, that doesn't look like she should be a sharp hay, but... She's kind of adorable, she's got kind of hairless looking. <laughs> I think she'd be a... Oh wait, Chi... Chihuahua, I got the pun now. I like... Chi is so cute, she's so tiny. Okay, let's go here. We did. Everything is happening so much. Chi, all you have to do is go through this opening until you reach a control panel. You should be able to reset the frisbee machine from there. We're counting on you. Alright, here goes nothing. I like to give her like a little fluttershy voice because she's so tiny and so cute. I think I fixed it. The frisbees look like they're moving at a more appropriate speed now. You really saved us. Thanks, Chi. It, it was nothing. I'm glad I was useful. I'll be going now. <laughs> so cute. Finally. To the cafe. <laughs> you going already? Come on. Let's play some frisbee first. Alright. Why not? <clears throat> let's go. Oh, and this is the yaoi part for you fangirls. They ran off. Seba is going for the frisbee! He makes a running leap. Can he catch it? He hasn't been doing well this season. Dying and all. He's got it! Huh? He's dropped it! That dumb Seba. Looks like someone's not going to the world championships. But what's this? Puss picked up the same fucking frisbee off the ground with his mouth! That's totally an indirect kiss! The gay is off the charts! 
thousand off pin. Oh my god. We don't need this commentary. I can't help it. My fur dosy after all. A fur doshi? It's so cute as hell. Had enough for now? Yeah, let's play again sometime. There's something else I wanted to say too. Uh, I love you. That's not it. I'm really sorry I screamed like that when we first met. I have never met anything, anyone who looked like you before, so I was scared. But you turned out to be so nice, so I'm really ashamed that I acted like that. Huh? I can barely even remember that. Don't worry about it. You can make up for it the next time we meet, huh? I will. With my body, says Diva. The two homo, the two homo doges look into each other's eyes. Cut it out already! <laughs> I love it! Oh, I love it! Okay, we're gonna check out. Ooh, Star Pugs! I got it. I got the pun. Alright, go, go here. <clears throat> Ooh, this is pretty cool. It actually looks like a little Starbucks. Those little pastries. I bet you're like dog treats and stuff like that. Welcome to Star Pugs. Can I take your order? We're just here for the Wi Fi. So honest. If you want to be here, you'll have to buy something using dog treats. Oh, but we don't have any dog treats. Then don't waste my time. Rude. <laughs> I know, right? It's like every time I go to Starbucks. <laughs> Alright, um. We're gonna save so this guy right here. We're gonna talk to him in the next episode. I'm gonna go save, and I'm gonna end off this episode right here. I love this game. I can't sing his praises enough because it's so damn funny. All the memes and such. All right, we're gonna save with Dave Pointer. Save there. Uh, I'm gonna take some ma medicine, and I might record some more later. I'm unsure. So, if you like this. Hit that like button faster than you can cast a spell. And I will see you next time in the next episode. Mwah!